caterpillar. It's a, it's a black swallowtail caterpillar, and they're non-poisonous. You, you can touch them. And we just got it home ready, and they uh, eat Queen Anne's leaves. They can eat celery. They eat all kinds of plants. But just make sure that you don't give the wrong plants. And I'll give you some information about the cocoon. So they need a stick like this to cocoon on, and they have to eat a lot. And they're... They just hang a web, and then their body just, like, builds into a shell. He doesn't cocoon like normal caterpillars. His body just... Changes. Like, yeah, changes to a phase. What are you doing, buddy? Can he eat all plants? No. What kind? Uh, Queen Anne's leaves, celery, what? and I forget the rest. Fennel, just in the carrot family. Yeah, just yep. in the carrot family. And what does he smell like? Oh, he smells very strong. He smells very... We put him in our bike bag, and we could smell the caterpillar all the way home, and now Aunt Lori's bike bag smells like a caterpillar. Yeah. But it's... He smells It's very uncanny. Strong. I've never smelled... An insect other than like a stink bug that actually produces that much scent. It's amazing. Hey, little guy. How you doing? What do you want to name him? I don't know. Honestly. And um, so we found some Queen Anne's lace in our yard. We might go up and get some celery leaves. Because those would be super fresh and moist and delicious for him. Uh, I'm just going to... And... Uh, Yeah, he will turn into a black swallowtail, which is a beautiful, beautiful black butterfly with these symmetrical, uh, powdery, shimmery, iridescent blue spots. It's going to be quite, quite a beautiful thing. Oh, did you find some Queen Anne's lace, buddy? We seem to have lost our host. I got more. Okay. Is he found it? Is he munching it? If he doesn't seem like he's munching it, we'll go to the grocery store and get some celery. Leaves. <laughs> I'm just going to put some just for a bath snack. Just in case he decides to eat in the bath and he's just too lazy. <laughs> Do you ever eat in the bath? Yeah. <laughs> I also eat in the bath. You do? Yep. That should be enough. All right. Well, this is, uh, this is really interesting, and we will post... I'm him all the leaves of this plant. We will post this. updates on this little guy. Oh, is he munching? Yeah, he is. Is he? Or is he just climbing? Or is he actually eating? He's actually... He was yes. eating for a second. He He's was eating for chompers. a... chompers. Yeah, his chomper... His feet kind of... Uh, hold on, wait. Here's one more thing about him. You gotta be very careful about this thing. It kind of stings. When the caterpillar is like on your hand, you have to brace yourself for something that stings. And his feet sting when he crawls on you. It like, it kind of suspectively just bee stings you. Oh. But it doesn't sting that much, but it does sting. I think it's just that his feet are so strong and they have a substance on them and they're kind of a little bit prickly so that they can get a good grip on things to hang upside down that it's just his prickly feet. I'm going to give him a nice stem. All right, want to give your sign off? It's C2 sign.